Everyone farts, including you and me, and your dog, if you have one. We wouldn't be human if we didn't. How many times have you had to excuse yourself from a room because you were about to blow up the spot with a loud wet fart? How many times did you try to hold your fart in for the sake of common courtesy on a first date, job interview, or even a crowded train until your face practically turned green? Quite a few times, I bet. Actually, it's quite normal to fart from 5 to 15 times per day. Farting is just part of digestion that reflects the activity in your gut. In this video, we will cover the top 5 reasons that causes you to fart. So stick around, you might just learn something. And please try not to fart, at least not till the end of the video. But before we go any further, please make sure to smash that subscribe button and click on the notification bell to be notified of our new videos. If not, you will fart a hundred times in a row. All right, let's get to it. Number one, did you know that every time you eat or take a sip of something, you are collecting gas that you would eventually be letting back out into the ozone, much to the discomfort of those around you? How is this possible? Well, this happens by whenever you swallow while eating or drinking, you are also swallowing air. The air you swallow slowly builds up and it causes oxygen and nitrogen to collect in the digestive tract and which eventually will be let back out in the way of a fart. Number two, when you digest food, gases like oxygen, hydrogen, methane, and carbon dioxide all collects which forms a buildup that can cause you to fart. Hydrogen sulfide is the gas that is responsible for stinking up the room. Consider it a snitch gas. What I mean by snitch gas is even if you disguise a fart, which makes no noise, it's the smell that gives you away, with eventually everyone glaring at you or laughing at you. Number three, your diet plays a factor as certain foods may be harder to digest than others. Foods that are high in fiber and raffinose, which is a complex sugar that causes gas. The excessive gas is formed as a result of the body having a harder time to process it. And we know how that normally turns out. Examples of these fart causing foods can be beans, broccoli, cabbage, Brussels sprouts, tuna, dairy, products such as milk and cheese, sodas, and other carbonated drinks. Number four, for those with irritable bowel syndrome, also known as IBS, stress, feeling anxious, and being nervous can cause your body to react with excessive farting. This is due to the strong mind and gut connection we humans have. It's similar to the feeling when the mind is in distress, when the gut will respond with the butterflies in the stomach feeling. For people with IBS, the gas is produced in the body and would expel at a faster rate when under pressure. That also explains why people poo or defecate on themselves when scared. But of course, these are extreme cases. Let's just keep it PG and stick with the good old fart. Number five, constipation can also cause more farting. As the waste sits in the colon, it will ferment, causing it to release more gas. If the person is constipated, they are most likely bloated, and the waste sits there even longer than normal, causing even more excess gas to build up. The gas has a harder time trying to pass, but when it does, it will wreak havoc on the world and the air. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a fart. Smash the subscribe button if you haven't already and click on the notification bell to receive updates on the new video uploads. Also, smash the thumbs up button and share with your friends who might fart a bit too much and always wonder why they did. Leave a comment below on what's your craziest fart story and we'll see you in the next video. Happy fartings!